Blog Talk Radio. Check out the full episode of this on Mental Like Patreon. In the name of Amen, the Supreme, the All Powerful, the One and Only True Lord, and Amen, we trust. As the Republican mental, like the real 144,000 is being gathered in this day and time, the mental. Good evening, I'm your host, the intellectual Nubin Minkari, and this is Mental Like Radio. And tonight we're going to be discussing why intelligent law abiding people are referred to as squares. Why are they referred to as squares? Right? What does a square denote? I really wanted to do this broadcast tonight because, you know, um, squares are ridiculed, you know, people who are uh, on a straight and narrow, the people who are not out here trying to get over on people, the people who are not trying to commit crime, just honest, sincere, you know, uh, viable people, good people, you see. Those people are considered squares, right? And there are not a lot of squares left in the world. It seems like in this world, in this 3D world, there used to be a time when you saw genuinely good people. It's always seemed like somebody got a little dirt on them, right? Or maybe they always had a little dirt on them we didn't know. But it just seems like to be popular in this world, you have to have some dirt on you. There used to be a time where we looked up to good people, law-abiding people, uh, squares. Let me show you the squares we looked up to, and nobody even know it. We looked up to superheroes, didn't we? Are superheroes the ultimate squares? Look at Superman. Look at Clark Kent, right, with his glasses. Ain't he a nerd? Don't he look like the ultimate square? But don't let the looks fool you because under them glasses, he's Superman. And he's, and then even Superman's a square. He's just a super square. So that means something. That means something where you have people who have power in being square, a.k.a. law-abiding, a.k.a. Uh, um, uh, uh, righteous, not crooked people, not people who are degenerates. Why are the intelligent law-abiding people referred to as squares? Simply because that's a really a reference to the fourth dimension. The beast knows that the fourth dimension is real, and he knows that righteous people are there. He calls that place heaven. See, the beast knows the fourth dimension is heaven, and that's where the righteous bronze people are. I remember years ago, back back in, well, not even years ago, back back in the 20s when the beast started making movies. They made this movie about all these bronze people in heaven and stuff like that, and they was dressed in white robes, and it was a black and white movie, and they were singing and whatnot. Not, so the beast, he, he sees that bronze people are worthy of that heaven or that haven. Why would they make a movie like that? They go from blackface to showing you bronze people in heaven with robes and stuff on, singing and being happy and whatnot as righteous people. So what that tell you? The beast didn't show himself being there because he know he's not righteous. He know he's a damn beast. How the hell a beast ever going to be righteous? That's why I said well, even when they're trying to be righteous, you always got to look at them with circumspect. You, can't, you can never trust the beast, man. You can never trust them. What do squares denote? Squares denote foundation, strong foundation, the building of something, the extension of something. What is opposite of a square? A tri- you know, well, not opposite, but under a square. Square, you know, you got the crooked, right, which is really what a triangle is. It's a crooked. Those are crooked angles because they don't all line up evenly. You see? They don't line up evenly. Okay? So they're crooked. And this is like the through third dimension. That's why everything is off here because it's crooked. This is why if you notice, one is, I'm going to let you know, get to know something. The reason why the beast can't give y'all equality is because it would throw off this system here if he made y'all equal. Because y'all would, it, it, y'all would go ahead of him and become supreme because you know how our people do. We take next to nothing and we excel. So imagine if we actually had money and things and was directed to do things and educated that our people was really trained to do things, we would excel. So they don't want to see that happen because then you would excel and outshine them. And it's being, it's more and more evident, right? Uh, who should be the squares? 
we should be those square people, and we should make our children that. We should be law and, law and orderly abiding people, people who are lawful and orderly, people who uh, abide by the law and the order of this land. We should be those people. We shouldn't be out here committing crimes and things like that. I'm going to tell you something. That's what the beast really wants. He wants you to, get, you to begin to be out here gang banging. He wants you out here shooting each other. He wants you out here shooting and killing each other and, and committing crimes and selling. They want you to do that because you fill up the prisons. And, and the prisons, you, you, you're nothing but money. You're nothing but money to them. You're nothing but a stock option to them in prison. You see, you keep whole towns eating off of you. Whole, all these, all these goddamn caucasoids who live in these um, places, especially upstate New York, where they sit, send you so-called blackmail. Y'all, they send y'all all over the place and, and house you in these places and all over the place. And you got the whole town, a bunch of Caucasians and whatnot, a bunch of the guys who work in the damn prison, and, and they just basically living off you. And your stupidity. Why should we want our children to be squares? Because the squares rule the world, and we're the natural squares, so we will eventually rule the world by nature. For the um, complete broadcast, you're going to have to go to Mental Like Patreon. Go to Mental Like Patreon for this complete broadcast, because it will not, I guarantee you, it will not be on YouTube. Subscribe to Mental Like Patreon and join the Mesoamerican community. Rising out the black race to the white race Out the black race to the white race We still was born with a mental leg Black race to the white race If it's hell, I'm in, then it's hell us They tried everything just to spell us Fed us religion, gave us fake gods Through all of that, we beat the odds Now we coming together under one flag